Hello everybody, <coughs> Josh here again. I think I have found one of the cheapest, in my opinion, ways to get aragonite sand. This is uh, calcium carbonate. It is from crushed corals and crushed shells. So this is about, probably about 30 pounds or so of generally a good grade, maybe a little bit more coarse than fine. But <clears throat> I got about 40 pounds of that, around $9. When you consider most places sell it for about $2 a pound or a dollar a pound, it's a lot cheaper that way. And so how did I get this? It's pretty simple actually. Um, it comes in a, a large 50 pound bag for $9. And you can sift it out the way I did it here. You get the more fine stuff, and you're left with a more um, coarse grade rubble kind of stuff here. So the product I used is this right here. It is a oyster shell and crushed coral bag for. Um, they use it to feed chickens in their food. That way um, they get uh, the eggshells, and that way they can create eggshells and create their eggs faster. So let me just pull this out here real quick. I need more room in here. All right, and that's how it comes right out of the bag. So you can see a little bits of coral. Let's see if I can find a nice bigger shell piece. Yeah, right there, there's a shell. So this is pretty good stuff on its own, but to make it a nice fine grade, I sift it out with the a simp simple colander there. I mean, you could use something that's a more f finer grade in there because those are pretty big holes. But I do like little varied, uh, varied size in my sand. So, for nine dollars for fifty pounds of this stuff, it's probably one of the cheapest versions of substrate that you can get that's still calcium. Uh, I heard people using play sand; you can get it for like three dollars a pound, but it's not aragonite. So, I'm also going to be using this to create my dry rock. So uh, I'll get back to you guys on that later, but yeah, this is one of the cheapest ways that I get my substrate, and I figured I'd pass along to you guys. So here's the substrate now, a couple uh, weeks later after I made the video. As you can see, it's a, uh, looks pretty well in the tank. And uh, the macro algae has had no problem with colonizing it. And yeah, that's a good substrate. Just to give you an example. Happy tanking.